Hey guys, my name's Kayla Amber, and today we're going to be making an apple spice soap. Another nice fall fragrance. I'm very excited for this. It smells really good, and once again, like my last soap, it has vanilla in it, so it's going to burn slightly brown. So today I'm going to try doing like a nice kind of striped soap. So I've got very fall colors today. So I'm using red vibrance, orange vibrance, and yellow vibrance, all from Nurture Soap. So to start off, we're going to mix in my additives. I have about a tablespoon each of Kaolin Clay, coconut milk powder, and colloidal oatmeal. So I'm just going to blend that in before the lye. Alright, so now we're mixing in the lye, and they're both about, the oils in the lye are both about room temperature right now. So I'm just going to strain that in, and then I'm going to stick blend it. Alright, so I think that's good. Let me just get this out of the way. So before I add the fragrance, I'm just gonna split off the colors. For the orange and yellow, I don't want any fragrance in it because I don't want it to discolor. So I'm just gonna pour those off. So this is a very nice light yellow. It looks kind of orange in the camera. Okay, so it did thicken up just a little bit. Probably good because you don't want it to be too loose and that like the colors are going to overmix. So I want them to stay pretty separate. So that's good. Those are really nice fall colors. I'm loving it. You guys might have a bit of a blocked view, so I apologize in advance. So I put it on a little towel there. I'm going to be going with each color along the side and making little stripes out of everything. Alright, so now we're going to begin pouring into the mold. See, this one's starting to thicken up just a little bit, but that's okay. I'm gonna put quite, oops, that was a little too much. I was gonna say I'm gonna put quite a bit for the first pass, but I don't want that much. I'm just gonna smooth that out, because that's kind of annoying. It's not completely on the bottom, you can't see it because this is tilted, but it's mostly to one side. Now we're going to go in with the yellow, quick little pass, like that. And we're going to go in with some orange, whoops, I should have moved that out of my way first, Let me just put a little there. And then I'm just going to repeat with those three colors, this is getting pretty thick. So I'm going to have to try working a little bit faster. And I do want the red uh, lines to be much, much thicker than the other color, so that's okay if it's a bit thicker. I'm trying to work fast here, but every two seconds I need to clean up the sides of the mold, which is just making the soap get thicker before I can pour it. I'm kind of losing my marbles here. I'm a haunted ship. Mom. She's a little excited about her uh, township. It's Halloween themed. <laughs> I'm leaving it on. I'm not always doing them in the same order. I'm kind of mixing it up. Just because I feel like it, you know. So let's see, my mold is almost full. I think I'm gonna uh, layer on the rest of the red. Then I'm gonna swirl the top. So let's try this out. 
Sorry, I didn't realize I was holding it right in front of you guys. All right, that's good. So now I'm just gonna put a little stripe of orange, I guess. I think I'm gonna try doing like little figure eights so they kind of look like leaves on top, you know? Or something like that, just kind of swirl them up a bunch. I do got a little bit of yellow that I'll put on top as well. And I actually have some red vitamins mica still mixed up because I didn't use it all. So I think I'm gonna just put a couple of dots everywhere. And of course, I got the mica all over me. We're gonna swirl this now. Maybe smack it down one last time. I'm just gonna try doing a little figure eights. What am I doing here? <laughs> I don't know how to do figure eights. <laughs> here, let me start from the top. That's better. I don't know what I did, but I'm not doing it right. But I kind of like that. Should I just do a little down the middle, up the side, maybe a little down here? Ooh, that's nice. It looks so folly. I love it. It smells so good. All right, so everything is cleaned up. I'm gonna do the sides a little bit more. And then I'm gonna spray it with rub and alcohol and then bring you guys back like in about 24 hours to unmold it and cut it. All right, so here we are back over 24 hours later. Here's what the soap looks like. Ooh, that's the end piece there. I like how that looks. It smells like apple cider. It smells so good. Oh, I really like how that turned out. You like it? Mm -hmm. It's cool. I like the colors. Yeah, very fall. Alright, so... <laughs> I always go to whisper first. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> it's very quiet in here. Alright, so here they all are. I really like how they all turned out. Really cool effect on all of them. Like the stripes, I wanted them to be kind of more straight lines, but I kind of like how they turned out. Very happy, pretty cool. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and oops. <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out my Instagram. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.